I'm Smithy, and get ready to watch the worst awesome nuts premiere of your lives. I'm horrible at this game, by the way. And I'm joining a match in progress. It's gonna be fun. Might as well play one of the most overpowered champions. No guts, no glory. I hope my team isn't failing miserably. I hope I don't fail miserably, to be honest. That's really what I want. Alright. It's on the new map, which is a plus. And it looks like the game just started. Which is also a plus. And the game did just start. Alright, so now apparently these people are higher leagues than me, but they're on my team, so it's all good. I don't like them. Except for the fact that it works for him. I think these people are about to be in the I think that really, really just let me kill it for the camera. And I applaud that sac noble sacrifice. And here's the purple This guy trolled by this game. Stunned by this. And then got thrown back. through that wall right there. Which I will talk about that wall in the game because I do have a problem with it as of right now. I don't know how to look at that stage. And I think that one person just raged at the game and just died. It seems to actually be better than the person I just left. That was a close one. But I, I made out alive and it's old. Go team. Hurrah. To be honest, I don't actually... I don't like playing Skull Deer, but no. Um, he does a little bit of a balance issue, I think. Especially when he gets the stuff power up and you can't see him. And you're just randomly pulling back into a turret. Then we're going to this whole map is based around you not being able to tell what you're doing. But he's a nice touch on the other maps. He just literally used up his uh, spell power. So. I actually think that was the five. Oh, uh, but I just killed two enemies actually, which I don't recall killing. This game is making me seem like a much better player than I actually am. My only chance is to like. Oh shoot! Go down. Whoa! At least I died to the turret, and not you to that turret bolt. And my killing spree's ended. Four, three, oh, the turret bolt's the only non-bond I honestly expected there to be more players, but I guess... You don't want to show up, and you don't want to show up. Here, my whole team is just chilling at the base. Maybe we should actually get onto the other lines. Maybe I should grab this stealth power up and show what I think is really in bad, really in balance. Maybe I should get stunned first, though, because as you can see, he 
School Gear has very, a lot of initiating mechanics, such as a whip, snare, stun, and yeah. I just find that kind of unfair in fact, you can literally just come out of nowhere and do that to you. And no one's gonna take that there because you guys are but, however, it does tell us that he was humiliated. I guess he's a plus. He always wants to be a I don't know, he's not a plus. He was gangbanging us all. If he's from the ghetto, he knows how to escape these gangbangs. Oh, I don't actually get these backstories. Obviously, no right here. We got our supporters. Oh. Well, that Durk will just save his life, so I hope, I hope it was worth the Durk. The Durk will sacrifice his life to save the Frog G and. Right now, it would be a very good Oh, and now we're migrating horse. Yes. Oh, and that was a team that was by practically everybody. But somehow I end up with the kill. Some of you are, you know, some people are saying, like, are they all bots? I think they're all bots now. Like, they're like, they're like, they're like, they're like, they're like, anyway, that one wall, I feel like, like, so I don't know if any of you got to this point to play on the new map yet, but the way it works is when you kill both of the second turrets, that wall doesn't disappear from the other side, so you can't easily access the base. I guess that's a plus on defense, but on offense you can get easily flanked, especially if you want to. I have to figure that out the hard way, and actually get the game and uh, die. So, this wall is very uh, tricky. And they are attempting to take the bots, I don't think programmed to take the stealth car off. And we just like and now this clunk is going to be destroyed. Maybe if I look at all the clunks. Oh no. Let's say, I remember I, I used to get decimated by the bots in this game. This game has a very, uh, I think I like the game is a very sleek thing to do. As it's... And it's like almost pra it's practically like nothing you've ever seen. It's like a mobile. But the idea is crazy. It's fantastic. This is a go watching something to what's it called? To debate on whether you're gonna use I mean, I one hundred percent recommend it. This game I think is my most played game on see. Maybe an uh, next TV episode. And I recommend not getting it on the consoles, because I heard the consoles don't receive that many updates. And unlike some people, I'm not going to blame the developers, because I know that is 100% the Microsoft's fault or Sony's fault. I don't know, like, they don't let their developers update games for free. 
They had bash in the back of their console positions. There was a big loss in that battle. Well, not a loss, but there was a big uh, controversy about that a while back. With the indie game called Harris, where there was like an indie game glitch, but Microsoft was going to charge them a lot to fix it. And that's when everyone sort of like made the concrete to Steam. Because after all, oh, no, I just tired. Because after that conversion of the players to Steam, a lot of other games started doing it, and they realized their business is actually doing good with Steam. I realized I should actually be buying stuff. And the slow. Uh, my opinion on this map, I think it is very good. It's probably one of my favorite out of all. I like the uh, one lane map, even though a lot of people hate it. But this map is also good. Because I think you have the unexpected element. While on the other maps there might be like one or two hitting little spots. This one is like, BAM, you're out of nowhere. And that stealth valve also adds to the effect. Even if the stealth valve doesn't have ways of hitting out waves. Like, even right here. I remember when first ran on this map, I even like go all of the spots. So the one in the top lane is the one that really got me, because it's no indication. I guess this platform is sort of an indication, but like I don't really get anything from that top lane anymore. These spots are doing a better job than the other players. And he did it again. I don't know, that time was intentional. Oh, that's not good. That was really bad thing on my part. There's, there's little jumping space in, there, in that bottom lane, which also contributes to the fact that you get ganked or screwed. Other maps, there's like leeway for escape. Like this map, you could juke a lot, but that bottom lane will be very hard to escape. You have like two giant bulky characters, like Clunker or something. Kill. I'm sorry, I'm just concentrating on the pattern. I need to add, you know, to learn it to get all the, pay your maximum solar up there. Uh, brings me on the topic. I usually don't get boost in this game. Because I feel like I don't really like it. Oh, why don't you get boost? You're so bad at this game. How could you say you're awesome? I'm sorry, I really said I was going to suck at this game. I like his, even if he wasn't, his abilities and what he does for him, he's a of his abilities. It's a supporty class without, like, making a heal support class. You know what it is here. Oh, and that was, that was the best play by me, as I looked back towards his turn. We 
just got wiped down. Fantastic. And our turret is being pushed while well, we're all dead. This is fun. On the other hand, none of them are positive, so we can't say that we're sucking. Even though we are. Well, actually, I don't know, we're doing pretty good. My Raylan's is not very good. I can never play Raylan. It's just like, not my style of champion. Like, I guess he's supposed to be like this massive burst damage person, but... I don't know. One, one thing is I probably, uh, I suck at it, so like, uh, the snipe shots. It's probably the main thing, to be honest. Oh, this Genji got the heal upgrade. So if I just go in there and turn back heal, I think. Oh, uh, not when he leaves me though, then we're not all good. Now this is the part. Oh, they fixed that. Cause I gotta swing, because I remember the first time I played this map, the first day, was, on the first day, that, that wall didn't disappear. I wish you could do though while you're like waiting for like this long time. I understand like in other MOBAs it could be up to a minute, which is why they let you spectate. But oh oh up here I feel like you should be able to actually see what your teammates are doing below. Like when you have an actual team, they'll be telling you. Well, hopefully, it seems like that's a but when you have randoms, it'd be good to see what your team's doing. Not if I... Not if you... Oh wait, how did that hit? Oh, like the little amateurs, I guess. Like I said, this map is a lot of juicy. And now that this wall is just gone, I can... Is that... Oh, they're waiting for the lift. I thought they were waiting for me to come out and be like... Oh, jeez, I didn't even And this is the end. Go. That was also not everybody, brought to you by me, who did a lot no, better no, than I usually do. And I'm usually horrible. So, so, I hope you liked it. And if you did, good for you. Have fun.